The Italian playmaker is probably best known for his vintage displays for Serie A club Juventus this season. But it's on another type of field that Andrea Perlo finds his passion away from the game. The legendary midfielder who led his country to the final of Euro 2012 likes nothing more than tending to his vineyard. Set in the idyllic countryside of Brescia in Italy, Perlo plans one day to put his footballing exertions on ice and focus on his lifelong love for the grape. No, facciamo... Well, we make four kinds of wine. We make a rosé, a white and two types of red. One is a standard red and the other is aged for longer and is better to drink. For now, I only think about playing football for the next few years. Then I'll definitely spend more time also at the vineyard. Like the bottles of wine that sit in his cellar, Andrea seems only to improve with time. The 33-year-old playing a vital role in Juve's rise back to the top of Italian football. Known for his calm and measured style of play, it appears a drop of vino from an early age may well be the secret to his success. He was always a lively but quiet child, or rather not boisterous. When he was small, he always tasted a little wine. When he got a bit older, not as much, but now that he's an adult, he likes to try different kinds of wine. There's little doubt that the World Cup winner will put a cork in any winemaking plans for now though, as the Italian champions prepare to host Celtic in European action on Wednesday. PLO will no doubt be hoping that he's toasting a Champions League title in Wembley come May.